Hi everyone. So many times I get questions that uh, what is the difference between CAD boosting machines, Axi Boost, Light GBM, and CAD Boost. So the beginners in data science field get uh, confused around all these terms. So I'll make it uh, clear for you. So GBM or gradient boosting machine was uh, developed by Friedman and he published this paper in February 2002 in computational statistics and data analysis. So in this abstract it clearly mentions what uh, GBM is. So GBM is uh, nothing but uh, additive regression models which uh, sequentially build trees on uh, current pseudo residuals. Right. So this is the idea behind uh, GBM where we build subsequent trees which tries to predict the residuals or errors made by the previous trees. So this is the original algorithm by Friedman. Then in 2016, Chen and Carlos in the uh, University of Washington came up with XE boost, which is a short for extreme gradient boosting. So they kind of uh, made the original algorithm more faster and uh, sometimes we get better results as well. So that was the idea behind XGBoost with the same algorithm but more scalable and uh, we get better results in many cases. Okay. So that's what they say. Let's see in abstract. XGBoost scales beyond billions of examples using far fewer resources than existing systems. So that is the idea behind XE boost. Then in uh, 2017, Microsoft launched Light GBM. Light GBM again focused on reducing the computational requirements for building GBMs. So you can see that uh, the table 2 which is shown here is the uh, comparison of average time cost in seconds for one iteration across multiple algorithms for different data sets. You can see light GBM is much faster than all of them. Then they checked the AUC for classification task to figure out how does it behave with respect to other algorithms. So here also we can see that uh, it's more or less same or better in many cases compared to other algorithms. Then in 2018, uh, Yandex launched CatBoost. CatBoost uh, takes care of categorical variables, this one. Second, it's uh, GPU optimized and uh, it's much faster than light GBM, that's what it says. So this table shows the comparison in terms of log loss. So you can see that uh, cat boost has the lowest log loss compared to all other contenders. So this table talks about the time which it takes to score. On a single thread, we can see that cat boost took around 2.4 seconds, exe boost took 78 seconds and uh, light GBM took 122 seconds for the example which this paper has considered. You might see different results based on your data and sparsity and other matrices. But the baseline of today's discussion was that uh, whether it's light GBM, exe boost or Get boost they are just a different implementation of gradient boosting machines there are no different algorithms at the baseline they are same but how do they build trees how do they select data how do they split individual nodes that differ from one implementation to other so for you the baseline is GPM the different implementation that takes care of uh, improving computational efficiencies and the way they split data or select data. Okay. 
hope it makes it clear thanks for going through this tutorial we'll see you in the next tutorial thank you